Definitely. The camera's kind of crooked, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'm Sab. <laughs> Did anyone ask? I don't know. So back in the olden days, we were just discovering the wonders of the men. Oh, of men. Oh, oh, okay. <laughs> when we were like 12 year olds, like any 12 year olds that were our age, that are our age now. Have you ever had a dream that that you um you had? What? what? Like any 12 year old back in 2011, we were obsessed with One Direction. Woo! Woo! Anyway, we wrote a lot of cringy stuff, including fanfics that we haven't seen since then, and we wanted to look through them and cringe at them on camera. We had a One Direction fan Instagram account, account yeah. Instagram fan account. Kevin flies in One Direction. Ke Kevin, Kevin underscore, underscore flies underscore, underscore in underscore one underscore direction. Underscore S2. It had no original content. Yeah, there. we had no original content. <laughs> I didn't know how it um, and then we also posted fanfics on there. And Sav doesn't know any of these fanfics. No, I don't. I had my own personal onesie account. <laughs> Oh they have God, like, I don't know, 20 chapters. We, or we have a lot. So, this is our first fanfic. Oh. It was written when Annika and I were like 11 or 12 or something like that. They're short chapters because you're posting them as like in an image. No, like an imagine be, post. Yeah, it was like, yeah. It was like, one of, like an imagine post, but then like it was a whole ass fanfic. How we did it was on our this one note thing. We had like, we would write comments on like each of the chapters that we write. I didn't even read the intro, but then Attica at the very bottom is like, dude, in capital letters, you need to work on your writing skills. <laughs> First-person perspective, it's easier. And then I was like in capital letters, you change it to first perspective. And then, <laughs> and I'm like, sorry, but I can't, it's too hard. And then the same like colon slash face. And then you're like, okay, dot dot dot. And then I did like colon smiley face, like D. I think she's like, I'm not making it to first perspective anymore, equal sign. And then I'm like, I've oh, noticed nice. tongue face. Equal sign. Like two equal signs with like the eyes. Oh, like oh, the eyes. I used that all the time. <laughs> so our names. Yeah, Isabel our name. is Lizzie. Attica is Kat. I don't know what my name is. How do you remember? It says here in the very top. Oh. So this is the intro. Ready? Okay. Serious stories playing mode. Finally, after waiting more than a year, One Direction is finally here for a concert. Why you finally <laughs> 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 Oh, I wrote it in second person perspective. Maybe that's why yeah. I was so annoyed. Yeah. Because I was like, who writes in second, second person? Because it was so start as an imagine pose. Uh, no. Uh, is it YN? Is YN? Is that what your name? Oh my gosh, no. After you and your friends send a fan letter saying that you really want to meet them, their manager, Paul, sent a letter back with three backstage This is such a basic setting. setting. I can't do the concert. Three days before the concert, you started to feel really sick and tired. Luckily, oh it was summer vacation, so you got to sleep and rest. The day of the concert, you were feeling a bit better, but when you're sick, you feel claustrophobic, especially with crowds. You also hated loud oh, okay. noises, and obviously yeah, the One Direction concert would be noisy. Person. And that's a major understanding. Well, understandment? <laughs> understatement! <laughs> And that is a major understatement. <laughs> Since you have waited long for this and worked it hard on planning preparing the letter that you sent, you keep thinking of solutions. Then it hit you. That's it! The letter you sent to your mom. We have backstage passes. Maybe you can ask if we can stay there for the concert. Oh, I made yeah. my mom ask One Direction if we could stay backstage. How old was our target, target audience? <laughs> After picking up your friends the day of the concert, you went to the arena. You see hundreds of girls waiting at the entrance, of screaming, of course. <laughs> We're not like other girls, right? Yeah. <laughs> you felt like barfing just looking and hearing them. You managed to hold in your puke. Same. <laughs> hold in your puke. <laughs> Same. Why is it so I don't know. Because she's sick. <laughs> and your mom and friends help you. Your mom. <laughs> to get inside the arena, plugging your ears and your friends guiding you as you squint your eyes. Your mom leads all of you to the backstage entrance and asks the security guards if she can talk to Paul. 
These are the girls who wrote the letter for one <laughs> These are the girls who wrote the letter as if nobody else yeah, wrote the letter. Yeah, it's no one else. <laughs> Dude, it's funny. It's like it's your mom talking. I know. And she feels very claustrophobic in crowds, and her ears are very sensitive right now. My mom said, I'm such a drama queen. Jeez. <laughs> I know. And then you're getting your friends to guide you back to What's wrong with you? you? <laughs> Literally like this. Paul thought for a while. I would have I would have to ask the boys if it's okay with them. The but boys, otherwise, the I guess it would be fine as long as they don't bother anyone working. Hold on, let me ask the boys. Paul left for a while but came back right away. They said it's fine with them, he announces. Your friends say thank you and your mom leaves soon after because she had to meet up with someone from work. Okay. You oh, enter with both friends behind you and immediately see five boys staring at you. The staring goes on for a while. These are men. You see five boys staring at you. Ew. Ew. Like, you walk backstage, and the moment you enter backstage, they're there just are looking five at you. That are staring, staring at you. Okay. And then, and then, the staring goes on for a while. <laughs> wow. Until, until one of your friends, Cat, broke the silence. Hi, she says awkwardly. <laughs> nice. You realize that Niall was staring at you the entire time, but looked away Wait, was once this you a, noticed. Was this a Niall magic? Yeah, it was a Niall magic. It started as a Niall magic. It is one whole story. It is one whole story. Okay. It started as a magic. Did finish it? No, why would we finish this trash? You look around for a place to sit because you felt dizzy from standing up too long. Niall and Liam quickly move some clothes out of a bench and guide you while you sit down. You lean on the backrest. Is this good enough? Niall asks politely. <laughs> oh, yes, thanks. You replied. <laughs> you look right at Kat who starts smiling at you. Yeah. She and Lizzie sit beside you and everyone but Niall leaves. He, he goes up to you and asks what your name is. Quiet. <laughs> back smiling and awkwardly ran back to the boys you stare at lizzie who gave you an i think he likes you look and start started giggling then you looked at cat and can tell that she was slightly disappointed oh yeah <laughs> oh my Niall's my favorite. No. <laughs> and i'm like is this all right with you she asked her concerned of course it is why do you even ask she replies too quickly you look at her with a tired look and says okay but it's not like anything will you suddenly hear whispers coming from the room the boys were into Oh my god. Went into. It sounded like Nyla and Zane. She seems nice, Zane was saying. Doesn't look half bad either. <laughs> wow. <laughs> wow. 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 Well, I was really insecure, wasn't I? <laughs> That's the thing. She's not the best in terms of looks, but I keep reading her letter over and over. Seems so sincere and honest, <laughs> Nyla was saying. I don't feel comfortable saying that I'm in love because her friend's letter says she likes Louis the best. He finishes sadly. But did you see the way she looked at you when she sat down? We gotta go. But remember, people can change. Zane reassures. You look at both friends on either side, both staring and smiling at you. Just then the boys entered along with some backstage crew. Both your friends try to stop smiling and cover it with a poker face. That didn't oh last too long. They started laughing hysterically. <laughs> oh my gosh, guys, shush up! <laughs> oh my gosh, guys, shush up! Oh my gosh, guys, shush, shush up! up. <laughs> they yeah, tried to shut up. Died the creep. The smile creeping up your face. Then, coincidentally, your eyes met up with Niles. You gave a shy but sincere smile at him, and he winked back at you. <laughs> Ew. That made you smile even more. Then you glance at Kat, who seemed to have seen the whole smiling and winking scene that happened with Niall. Her expression showed even more disappointment, but also Poor happiness. Cat. And you could tell she was thinking about something. But her face suddenly lit up as Harry approached us. So, oh. <laughs> if you want to, you can stay in the wings of the stage and watch the show there. Or if you prefer, there's a monitor in the room and the show and that shows the concert as well, he says, smiling at Kat's direction. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> he looked at him, then at Kat, and saw that she was happy, almost like she was dreaming. Oh, um, thanks, you say. Um, can you please show us the room? Just don't want to get lost. Sure, this way, Harry says happily, and shows you, and shows you the way to what looked like a dressing room. What room were we in the first place? <laughs> the the waiting room! I thought backstage! Yeah, the backstage like, is an area! No, I, I, I think you were just literally, like, in, like, the hallway. Yeah, I'm, I'm kind of imagining like a. Why were there clothes in a bench in the hallway? Because that's where the change. I don't know. Like <laughs> a, the changing room. <laughs> this is one of our 
our dressing room, but you can stay here. Cat was still staring, but this time he replied, Thanks! You're welcome, he said. Oh my gosh, he spelled your, like, Y-O-U-R. Ew. Ew! Okay, I would've corrected that. <laughs> we posted this. I know. Part four. That's juicy. Okay. Both you and Lizzie stare at Cat, who stared. <laughs> It says stared. Who stared to smile? Started to smile. <laughs> hey, can you guys go to the wings and tell me if it's loud there? You asked Lizzie and Kat. Are you sure you can stay here alone? Lizzie questioned. Yeah, sure. I just want to know if it's good in the wings and not too loud. Okay, Kat said. Be so right back. Wings. And with that, they both left. You look around. There are clothes everywhere and silly string on the wall. Just then, Niall entered the room. Oh, of course. Hey, sorry to bother. I just forgot my lucky bracelet here. He says, looking at the ground. Oh, haha, ha, that's fine, you say. Oh, ha, ha. Oh, ha, ha. <laughs> Finds the bracelet and starts to put it on. He struggles a bit, with the performance time closely approaching. Oh, no. You know what? Why don't you just put the bracelet on and stay in the wings? I don't have time, he asks, eagerly. What? <laughs> what? 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 Why do I don't have time to put this bracelet on, but why don't you put the bracelet on? <laughs> what? And then the time it takes for me to tell you to put the bracelet on is I could have put it on. Time. then yeah, I guess I can. But by any chance, do you have anything to block the noise from the crowd that still lets me hear you oh guys? Gosh, you Is it gonna give you your You inquire. Yeah. Oh, wow, look at me oh. with my big brain <laughs> Niall thinks. That's what he's saying. Niall thinks. Niall thinks. Wow, that's good to know. Ah, I know, an earpiece. Here. Oh my oh. god, it gives you an in-ear. Oh, predictable. Thank Here. you, you try to yell, even with your sore throat. Thank you. <laughs> Slowly stand up. At that moment, Lizzie and Kat came back and look at you. They see the earpiece and the bracelet and start staring at you, demanding some answers. <laughs> that took him so much longer. I'll tell you later. You have to go to the wings quickly. You shout and slowly but briskly run out the door. Lizzie and Kat following. You end up back where the bench is. This where was this bench? bench? Why, no, why is there such a special bench, guys? <laughs> you go back where the bench is. What's the point that of going into the dressing room and then? Because because Harry is just showing us where the room is in case we wanted to watch from there. Uh, like, okay, okay. So you, my end, my you, know, yeah. you told your friends Lizzie and Kat to go to the wings, and then you left the dressing room to go sit on the bench. No, I was gonna go to the wings, and then on my way to the wings. I went to the bench. But why? Because that's just the stopping point. Wait, listen. Okay, okay. You end up back where the bench is. Kat and Lizzie catch up to you and you sit down. Gah! Gah! <laughs> I shouldn't have done that. My head is spinning, you complain. Are you okay? okay? Where are you going? They ask in unison. Oh no, it's starting. We need to get to the wings. Why were you so desperate? Because I'm Niall's lucky charm. Oh, <laughs> right, 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 right. <laughs> that's not English. Wait, what? <laughs> but, Kat started, really, where's the wings? I can tell you there. Where's the wings, comma, I can tell so you there. there. Yeah. Because, oh, because we're really? Asking, like, where's the wings? Asking, like, I can so tell you there. there. Okay, yeah, yeah, okay. They help you get up and lead you towards the right way. Then you see now word until he sees you and smiles. Wow. You give him a thumbs up <laughs> and he, his grin widens. What did you do? Quickly put the earpiece on because the shrieks and screams are getting really loud. When the screams died down for a quiet song, you explain to your friends what happened. Aww. Wyans in love. Wyans in love. Wyans in love. Kat says with her mocking baby voice. You all Aww. laugh. Then you say, I think it's the other way around, but I shouldn't get my hopes up. I mean, me? For a really cute guy like him, highly unlikely. Wow. Then, like friends always do, they tell you that you're beautiful and that any guy would be lucky to have you. You're beautiful. Always count on <laughs> Always count on your best friends to make you feel special. Aww. They all help you get to the couch in the dressing room, and you lay down and Zane and Harry leave. Kat enters the room with without a chair but with a bottle of water. Hey, there you are, Lizzie said. How'd you know we were in here? I saw Zer Zeri. <laughs> Zeri. I saw I mean, Harry and Zane come out, and I saw they exited through the right wing, so I asked them where you guys were. Wow, I'm smart. Wow! <laughs> big brain, <laughs> big brain. Niall was also there, and he said he was going to come by before the intermission is over. You couldn't stop yourself from smiling. <laughs> ew, ew. <laughs> okay, okay. I want to get to the water bottle part. That's what the magic was that sparked this whole thing. 
There's no chance he would like me, he thought. I'm nowhere near his standards. Suddenly, Niall enters the room and sits by your feet. Are you okay? He asks you. Ah! This part is true. I wrote this part. Yeah, you can see the amount of concern in his eyes. I yeah, I he started. Then you got interrupted by Kat. Ahem, <laughs> er, um. <laughs> Hey, I got to use the bathroom. Lizzie, you want to come? <laughs> Lizzie looks at Kat and imme immediately knew what she was up to. Unfortunately well, for them, way mad you know what they were up to as well, and you try to stop them. <laughs> Unfortunately for them, you know what they were up to as well, and you try to stop them when Harry passed by. No, you stop them when Harry passed by. And Why don't we know what punctuation is? I don't know! Um, Harry, can you show us where the bathroom is? Kat asked in a rush to leave you. Oh, I get it now. Him. Oh. Because I was like trying to stop you guys from leaving, but, but then Harry I saw Harry, it. and yeah. then I was like, oh no, Annika should go with Harry. I mean, Cat, sorry. Oh, Cat should right. go talk yeah. to Harry. Okay, what I guess. Okay. Me and Harry. Oh, um, this way. Oh, that's so classic, Harry. Um, 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 <laughs> um, um, this way, Harry said, escorting Cat and Lizzie out. You realize that Cat accidentally took your water with her. She took my water, you said with a sad face. <laughs> Being half sarcastic and half real. Oh wait, this is the water. Since it's just water and you weren't that thirsty. Oh, I'll get you some. Be right back. Oh, Niall said eagerly. <laughs> oh, sure. Niall said eagerly and started to stand up. You sat up quickly and shouted, No, no, it's okay, I'm fine. Niall turned around, looking a bit hurt, but not too disappointed. What? <laughs> Are you gonna get you water? <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't think I can stain the wings right now, you say sadly, and start to take off the bracelet that Niall wanted you to wear. Why do you guys do that to him? He stopped you. It's okay, you can not You can keep it, he said. I have other lucky charms, he said awkwardly. Oh, you think he's referring oh. to, to y YN? To YN? To Yun? <laughs> to Yun? Okay, you see. Stared, so, like, <laughs> right? Yo, stared into his beautiful blue eyes for a while. <laughs> oh, I'm so glad we didn't say blue orbs. You started to cough. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna get you that water Six now, feet. he said, and left reluctantly. Six feet. Don't cough. So awkward. Dude, you made him mad by not letting him get you water. <laughs> <laughs> you patiently wait for him to come back when you heard whispers come from outside. Again? It was <laughs> Why are those whispers? Again? <laughs> they, they must be really close when it comes to these things. I really don't know, man. I will say she's just special. And I, <laughs> so I rarely had her. Man. <laughs> Niall, why? See, he replied, "I understand you, and I encourage you too. But just remember, try not to fall too hard right away, and be yourself. Be yourself. Oh my God. <laughs> Here you go." Niall said as he sat down beside you and handed over the water bottle. Thanks, he replied, shake and no, oh, you replied shaking shakily and took the water. Thanks. <laughs> As you take out the sip, you realize that your toes are tucked underneath the side I, of I, the I, I, I wrote this part. I wrote this part. I wrote this part. I wrote this part. A 12 year old feels like <laughs> moment. This is, this is, this is, this is you right now. Yeah. Like, right like that. I'm really like, thankful you wrote this part. You continue to drink your water, sip after sip, and now just kept looking at you with those bright blue sip eyes. Oh my so god. I have to go now, Niall says dismayed, said dismayed, as you quickly remove your feet from the side of his thighs. I definitely wrote see, this because I wrote dismayed. Made. Like, yeah. I'm not trying to be pretentious here, man. <laughs> trying to? I am. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for everything, you replied, also smiling. Oh, can you get my friends? You finished embarrassed. Sure, and with that. Why is he always embarrassed, dismayed? <laughs> He's so awkward. Reluctant. He's literally a soft boy. Yeah. He's a sad Soup. soft boy. <laughs> Shortly after, Lizzie and Kat returned laughing. Sorry we took so long in the bathroom, Kat said sarcastically. So, Lizzie said, eager to hear what happened. Look, I'm tired and I want to rest. I don't want to go through the rush of excitement and the stress of having to explain everything to you. No! <laughs> Whoa! Why are you so angry? <laughs> you say as you start to lie down and hand the water bottle to Lizzie. Oh gosh. <laughs> this is the water bottle thing. That's this is what sparked like the whole thing. Hey, this is what inspired inspired the whole thing. Okay, right. come on, listen carefully. Oh. Hey, what's this? Lizzie asked as she pulled out the label on the water bottle. She shows it to you, and you can't help but smile. It read, "Feel better." Dot X X. Now you Yeah. Yes. Yes. No. Never gonna 
throw this water bottle away. Well, at least the label you said and smiled as you dozed off. It was someone smoking weed. <laughs> Why would you say you? Cat wakes you up quickly saying that it's her last song. You but get I, up, I went to sleep. Yeah, you oh. dozed off. The last song was none other than What Makes You Beautiful. <laughs> you look in the chair that Cat set up for you and calmly sit down. After that little nap you took, you feel much better. Jeez, it's like I had freaking cancer. Like, what is this? <laughs> you watch as they continue their encore performance, staring at Niall the entire time, watching his every move, only hearing him sing. Ew. Wow. Ew. How could it be? Why him? You keep asking yourself, until you notice it was Harry Solo at the end. And better yet, you see him glance at Cat. Oh, wow. It was, <laughs> it was Barley. It was Barley, barley. a second. <laughs> barley a second. <laughs> It was barely a second, but you knew that he was singing to her. Oh. Oh. Baby, light up my world like nobody. To this girl. Okay. The song ends and the fans scream, so you go back and sit on the bench with Lizzie and Cat, with Lizzie and Cat by your side. You heave a big sigh. I'm tired. I want to sleep. You say you just slept. I'm tired. I want to sleep. You say. But you and your best friends know exactly why you sighed, and it has nothing to do with sleeping. Yeah. Uh huh. Cause you didn't just sleep for almost an hour during the. There you go. Oh, that's it. <laughs> Come on. I am cat. <laughs> oh, but what did happen was someone's falling for you, and that someone is. Just then, Niall and Zane turn and look at us. Oh, uh, hi guys. I can't believe I slept through the entire second half, you say, in hopes of changing the subject. Yeah, but at least you saw the last song, right? Niall says, grinning. Yeah, and I must say, you, uh, it was amazing. <laughs> <laughs> you say, partially to keep a conversation going. You didn't realize that you were falling into a daydream into daydream lines again by looking into those sparkly blue eyes. Yeah. Orbs! <laughs> Might as well say orbs. Uh, okay, we're gonna skip. Wait, wait. What wait. happens after the concert? Why is there 12 so more chapters long. after the concert? Right. Oh, is your mom? Ew! I just want to go to like the really cringy part. Boys, let's just leave these lovebirds alone, shall we? Lily. It's getting quite hot in here. You were shocked to hear her mention your name. She's a wonderful person. She's funny, nice, good looking, sweet. <laughs> yeah. Cat's gonna be sitting on your lap in the car. Oh. Lou shouts to Harry. Harry didn't seem to mind. He actually seemed quite happy. And oh he looked at Cat. Oh, oh, no. Oh, no, 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 he caresses her face before tucking a loose strand of hair behind her. <laughs> Harry looked like he had the right of his life. Ew, I was gonna, ew, oh my God. You turn quickly to Niall and manage, please don't try to top that.